Hey Bernard here. My message is titled Sin and the Sin Nature. Sin and the Sin Nature are the same thing. Sin is what happened after the fall of man, and sin nature is the result of the fall of man we all receive at birth. I'll give you an example. First, the sin. Now, the sin is when you're doing something wrong and you know it, but you still do it. That is sin. Romans 5 12 says, Wherefore, as by one man entered into the world and death by sin, so death passed upon all men. And that, for that all has sinned. Now in 1 John chapter 1, verse 8 through 10, the Apostle John tells us, If we say we have no sin, we deceive ourselves of the truth. Not in us, but if we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us of our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. If we say we have not sinned, we make him a liar. This is the word is not in us. The Bible says in Romans 3.23, For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. All here means both you and I. Romans 3.10, the Apostle Paul says again, there is one, none righteous, no, not one. So, as you can see, we are going to fail God, and we're going to make mistakes and sin. God knows that, and He knows we are born with the sin nature. And there are going to be times when we're going to let Him down. So, you may say, Kelly, what should I do if I, if I sin, and I don't want to sin, and I know God knows that I have sin, and I want God to see me sinless. What can I do? Well, I've got some good news for you that you're going to like. God can see you being sinless. All you have to do is ask Him for, to forgive you of your sins. Now, God's got a big eraser. So, when He forgives, He takes out and uses it. And He erases all of it. Then, boom! God sees you with no sin. As you can see here, there is a way to... To have no sins in the eyes of God. Also, you never know when you're going to die. So you might want to be forgiven. And you have, have your heart right with God. For without Jesus, there is no hope for spending eternity with God. So, this is the end of my message. And remember, you can always ask for forgiveness. I hope you enjoyed this message. If so, please give me a like and share and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And when you want to forgive yourself... um. Mean it. You don't just say, God forgive me. Amen. You gotta mean it. And uh, this is Kelly Bernard. Jesus loves you and so do I. And God, and to God I give all the glory.